Hi everyone, I'm Jessica and today we're going to be doing paper snowflakes. So I have what I need, a piece of paper and scissors and we'll get started. The first step is to fold your paper into a triangle. I've included some templates for you to follow. So you create your triangle here. You help your client's hands. You can do hand over hand assist, help them push it down, really use those muscles and you're left with this strip. And the next thing we want to do is to cut it off. Now that I've trimmed the edge off my triangle, I'm left with this, it's a square. So what you want to do is you're going to want to fold it in half again, like so. Crease it and make sure it's straight. And then this part, is a little bit tricky is you want to try to fold it in thirds as much as possible. So something like this and then like this. As you see mine doesn't line up so I'm going to fix it until it does. Okay then you'll end up with something like this. See it's in thirds and so we're gonna trim off this these tails to make an isosceles triangle. And you're left with this. And now we can start cutting out our snowflake pattern. So here's where you can get real creative. You can cut out your own patterns or you can follow any of the templates that I sent. So I'm just going to do a little bit of a rough cut and see what we end up with. Don't be afraid to take off a lot of paper because then you can leave thin snowflake patterns behind. And don't be afraid to cut from both sides too. So I'm gonna do a little bit here. So I have about this much left and I'm gonna do a little bit on this side. Maybe a little rounded, maybe a diamond shape. and then we'll see how it ends up. You unfold it carefully. So we have something like that, and I think the clients will really enjoy decorating their room for the winter season and kind of seeing what results from a little bit of random creativity. Hope you enjoy, thanks, bye.